this will be the video series on thermodynamics and in this thermodynamics we are going to cover topics like laws of thermodynamics entropy gibbs free energy and uh, more subtopics inside thermodynamics so we are not going to cover uh, you know large topics in one video so the video will be quite short like 5 to 6 minutes and i don't want to put much information in a video so it will be you know easy to revise if you want to see this videos now uh, the first topic will be laws of thermodynamic and let's start with first law so first law is as you all know energy of a system of a system is conserved so what does it mean so we all know that energy is neither been created nor is nor destroyed rather it changes its form from heat to you know sound to etc in thermodynamics we generally represent energy with heat and work so we say that heat energy will transform into work and work done will you know increase the heat of the system so that's how in thermodynamics we'll deal with the system so let's write the you know first law numerically numerically it's written as u equals to h minus p dp so don't get confused by this equation this u is nothing but internal energy energy h is the heat of the system heat content of system and this p dv is nothing but work done so before moving ahead and describing each term one by one let me just quickly tell you the convention the convention is pretty easy now in this thermodynamics we'll follow the convention of chemistry and you know i will in next video only i will discuss why in physics we write work done as pdv and in chemistry we write work done as minus of pdv so why there is a sign change so that's just you know change in reference in physics and chemistry so i'll discuss that in the next video for now what the convention is heat inserted in the system heat or you can say i should write energy energy inserted in a system energy inserted positive and energy law energy out is negative so that is the you know convention so heat coming to the system will be written as positive and heat going out of the system is written as negative so generally work which is nothing but pdv is work done by the system done by the system what does that mean that means this energy is going out of the system because system is doing work and losing some energy so since it is done by the system and energy is going out of the system it is generally written as minus pdv that's it so don't get confused minus pdv means work done and h is heat content of the system or heat in the system that's it so this is the first law of thermodynamics so i have given you an intuition that how you know this signs are written and you i can also give an intuition how this h minus pdv is written so we can say that net energy of a system is nothing but u internal energy so that u is nothing but heat of the system heat content of a system and work which is done by the system so if the system has done some work has done some work so that is nothing but minus pdv a heat content is nothing but h so total energy is thus divided divided into two part one is total energy is one part is heat content of a system and other part is work which is done by the system so that's how it is written as h equals to u equals to h minus pdv so that's all uh, we studied 
first law of thermodynamics which is nothing but h minus p dv and we got a minus sign because work is done by the system we know the convention that heat or energy entering in a system is positive and going out of the system is negative that's why work is done by the system energy is going out of the system this thing is negative also we got the intuition that total energy is divided into two part heat and work so that's how we are writing where heat is this h simply heat is coming to the system h and work is done by the system negative so we can also write like this u equals to uh, total energy equals to heat plus work so that's the first law of thermodynamics so i hope it's clear first law energy of a system is conserved and basically in thermodynamics we deal with heat and work so that's how we got this equation so i hope you like the videos thank you